Hello, my name is Jennifer, and welcome to part 43 of House 4 of the Drifter Challenge. And if you are returning, welcome back. And it's very early on Wednesday morning, of course. Dominique is going to be going to work today. She, let me check her needs here. She kind of needs to have a shower, but I think before we do that, I'm going to have her come out here and there is no chrysanthemum, so we're going to sell everything else. I'm going to super sell. And we'll come over here and I was going to harvest the forbidden fruit because that is one thing that I will eventually pass down to Emmeline and then she'll have to pay for it before she can do anything else, just like what we've been doing. It's sort of something like I think I've commented about it before is because her the first our first drifter completed the plant sim or the forbidden fruit whatever the magic bean challenge whatever they called it <laughs> and got the thing and it became perfect maybe with her maybe with her her grandmother I can't remember exactly so now that we've done that we are going to I only want one that's all we're going to super sell so you don't actually get I think you get like one per day kind of thing so it's not actually a lot and she is hungry hopefully she'll look after herself he is eating and yeah she's coming out I don't know why you're coming out probably to come ask for advice for something pause <laughs> let me pause let me see what do I want to hit uh, nothing really so I guess empathy would be the one I would want to hit if I had to take a hit on anything so we're going to come here and we're going to, not with her, <laughs> on her mom, supercell everything. <laughs> that might interfere with her asking, possibly. And there's this dirt, which possibly would be, fingers crossed, was fixed with the update. I don't know, but I am pre-recording this before the update. So if it was, <laughs> it looks like this unnecessarily. But I don't like to go into my 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 let's play saves until everything is like for sure better. So we're gonna evolve that plant, and we have enough time. I'm going to actually let me see. I think she needs to have a shower. She did, so I think we'll have her take a shower, and then if there's time, I'm going to have her. Mm, I was gonna say go to space, but I don't know. She goes to work. She's going to work at nine. 10. She goes to work at 10, so she may have time for a... She probably, depending on how long it is, she could possibly have time to go into uh, space. We'll let the others just do their own thing, but I'm not going to tell her to do anything until she's finished with her shower, because I don't want to have that glitch that I sometimes get when she comes. Like, we got that one time where she kept turning. <laughs> We're going to come ask for gardening tips. I don't know if we need them. My guess is we've maxed the gardening skill. We have indeed maxed the gardening skill. But we can check pockets for seeds and see what we get if it's anything. There's our forbidden fruit. And it looks like we got something we already had. <laughs> so we're going to come here and uh, explore space. Perhaps whenever. Are you going to school having to go to the bathroom? Why are you not going to school? I mean, I know I, it's fine that you're going to the bathroom, but why is it not showing you going to school after you go to the bathroom? And I don't think we can tell him to go to school. I didn't know we're already coming down here, but I don't think we could tell him to go to school anyways. Maybe his needs weren't very good. He did get an A recently, so he is an A student. But I don't think I tried to... No, I didn't. He's not supposed to be staying home from school. So his manners, so I was working a little bit with his manners and a little bit with his responsibility. And staying home is not going to help you. But she's already gone. <laughs> she's already gone to space. We are going to try to grab ship. I, if it wasn't for the fact she was about to go to work, I probably would have just worked on upgrading the ship as opposed to going to space. But going to space will help her with their fun and won't make her hygiene go down. So we're going to try to repair it and and see what happens. And we got that. So he, she found a space rock and supposedly our notification wall is full. So I'll probably just delete that. And it has work starts in an hour. So hopefully she gets back actually. This is taking it. The downside about putting, one downside about putting the rocket ship 
down there. I like it because you can't see it as well from like the world, the world map and stuff like that. And when you come in, you don't see this big rocket ship standing there. But it means they got to go all the way down the stairs to get to it. So that's the, that's the negative of having it down there. Are you going to actually go to school? No, you're not. Can you go to school? I don't know what glitched you. Oh, we have another. Oh, this is not. This is we're going to ignore them. So, no, oh, poor some other poor kid got 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 picked on instead. So, I don't think we're going to get I think we finished this the space adventure. So I will be back when she gets to work because I don't think anything's going to happen between now and then because she, she's probably going to like get the pop up while she's still in space. So I'll be back. So we have our regular message about daily experimentation. Ooh. So we have to browse. We have to detect aliens. Click on the sal satellite dish. Okay. So we're going to do that. That's easier. No, we can't. We have to actually upgrade it first. <laughs> Let's continue upgrading continue upgrading it so that we can detect aliens because <laughs> we have not done that yet so let's get that done quickly and we're gonna have that flashing red thing for him all day I don't know what happened with him so we upgraded that so we're done no you're not going up there you don't need that we need you to get full beakers so detect local aliens helps you with your fame so let's do that and then we're going to browse the web on the computer, which is under web. Browse web. Keep a watchful eye out for them. Because it said she de successfully detected them. That was quite the, <laughs> the effect. <laughs> so we're going to come here and we're going to have her do this. Looks like it needs to be fixed. Something's dirty that's weird no we're not gonna take that call sorry and he may as well work on a skill so now we have to mind control to sit and to really that's just we're gonna we're gonna come here and we're going to do a tainted serum Hopefully that doesn't use up our, <laughs> our forbidden fruit. That was 250 simoleons. Perfect. I should have left it in the chest at home. That's where I should put some of this stuff. So come over here, my dear, and do this. I guess we're going to have to do the mind controlling after all. I don't know why he's got... Oh, he, is he an alien? Is that why? Because I, I saw... <gasps> he's an alien. I bet you. Ah. Oh, we have to calibrate. So let's do that. I was going to come up and talk to him or do something with him. But we'll do this instead. We're going to calibrate. Can't wait till it's 3 p.m. So that we don't have to see that flashing light down there in the corner. Attempt alien contact. There we go. I'm ready to move an alien in whenever at this point. I know we haven't got everything done. We haven't got our level 10. We haven't got Dad, of our career ready. or rocket science. Transform a barrel. Is there a barrel? <laughs> is this a barrel? I don't know that that's a barrel. Maybe this is a barrel. Let's try that. <laughs> Let's hope that counts. We're not. We're, it's already 2 o'clock in the afternoon and we've only got one beaker. That's not very good. And the only downside about using that as my transform barrel is it's like... Oh, look. I didn't see the door there. We got a little drink. Spark drive serum. serum. Do we have some spark drive serum? It's untested. Makes you energized. Okay, drink that. And hopefully it doesn't make you pass out. Because sometimes it can. <laughs> Even, oh, look, we must have transformed that at some point, too. There's our dead garden. <laughs> which I need to replace at some point. But not right now. Oh, we have to explore in the rocket ship. Yes, we can do that. That's a good one. Because we need to increase our rocket science skill. <laughs> we usually do that once we finish our work tasks for the day. And we're not actually really very close. We only have one beaker and almost to the second one, but not quite there. So we'll see whether this is one we've had before or if it's a new one. Turbulence ahead. We're going to have to attempt a landing. 
So we have to do some repairs. So we don't have an option. We're just going to hit OK. So now we have a pop up to the east. A jagged series of rocks stabs upward toward the alien sky. It looks like a cross between a mountain range and a pile of shrapnel. Dominique can see a lone curl of smoke rising from one of the peaks. To the west, the valley looks much easier to traverse, but there are no obvious signs of life. We're going to head... We're going to brave the mountains. Dominique does her best to scale the impossible terrain, but it proves too difficult. She resolves to get more exercise when, if she gets back home. The Western Valley is the only way left to go now, but the light is starting to fade. So now we have to head west. And I'm not sure what happened. So what happened was there is just enough light left for Dominique to make out a large camp. But whoever was staying there appears to have left for safer shelter. Turning toward the sound of a deep growl, she spies a pack of monstrous beasts sniffing the ground not far away. The planet isn't safe. Dominique decides to attempt the flight home without the replacement part. And then she made it home. And she didn't crash, so everything is okay. So she has to drink or give away ox strength serum so we're gonna see whether we can find it in our under friendly we do not have it already since we don't have it I don't really want to take the time to make it right now I am going to just do one of these mind controls we are going to change outfit athletic to start and then maybe we should actually just go do it with someone else. He's a... Uh, why is he in that outfit? <laughs> Didn't we change him the other day? Why is he not in his normal outfit? Change outfit. Formal. He's dirty too. He needs to have a shower. Yeah, what's wrong with you, Kirk? Oh, you're going to go have a shower. So we're not going to mind control you because you're not going to be here. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> poor... <laughs> Every day. Poor, poor Benjamin. We're back. <laughs> We're back. <laughs> Mind control. Change outfit. Every day. And oh no, you're going to go to the bathroom on me. This is not working to try and see if it helps to do it with a different sim. Not a good, not a good strategy. <laughs> Maybe if they were closer together, it would work better. So let's try this one more time. Mind control. Change outfit. And we'll put him in athletic. I was planning on leaving him in this, which is why I did his everyday clothes. And then we'll mind control to sit. Hanubash. Even though he's already <laughs> sitting. <laughs> so I'm not really sure what the point of that is. Unless we don't have to. Let's see. I can't imagine this is going to get us up. And oh, actually, she came home. She's an A student. And we're going to build skill painting. And just... We need to analyze a DNA sample. I don't know if we have one to analyze. So we're going to friendly. <laughs> After we made you do these things, we're going to ask for a DNA sample. <laughs> and I can understand why you wouldn't want to <laughs> since we just did those things. <laughs> oh, thank you, Benjamin. <laughs> thank you very much. We're going to mind control you to sit also. Because we've done all this mind controlling so far, we kind of want to finish it off. And even though you're already sitting, we're going to mind control you to sit too. There you go. And then we will see whether we need to do that. We'll do these mind controlling and see whether that helps. What time is it? 512. Where did you get on your rocket science skill? You're not quite nine and a half. <sighs> My most hope for thing is to get our promotion today by far yes <laughs> that's what I want so get over here and let's see all the little numbers and stuff around them after <laughs> yay and now we got use the sim ray on a co-worker well I think we've done that enough thank you very much so I am actually going to I don't know if she has enough time. We'll just have her go to space one more time for whatever length of time is left here to see whether she, you know, gets a boost at all. She's at 49%. We'll see where she gets when she, you know, gets the pop-up for going home. I don't think she's going to finish this space mission while she's at work because there's an hour left and I'm not going to extend her work day just to have her, have her do it. So we have space pirates. I'm going to talk to them. Dominique speaks in her most comforting, non-threatening voice and explains to the 
pirates, how very disappointed she'd be if they stranded her in deep space. But these pirates don't get where they are by being empathetic. So they tear the wiring out of her menticular fusion box. Hmm, might be a little hard to land the ship without that. Oops, sputter home, fingers crossed. Oh no, she crashed. <laughs> She's gonna be dazed. Not good. She made it home before work. <laughs> Let's see her crawl out. Oh, look at her. <laughs> She's dazed for four hours. So now can we order someone to fix it? <laughs> Let's see. No. No rockets can be worked on. <laughs> so she's going to have to rebuild it. At least she doesn't have to seem to pay for it. Okay, so now that we've got that, can we now order someone to work on it? No. Nope, nope. It's all ours. All ours. We have to do it. So... So you can't, you can have them build it in the first place, but I guess once, <laughs> once you've crashed it, all bets are off. You got to do the rebuilding. So she is, uh, hopefully nothing, nothing happens. So she's focused from the science lair tra trait. And did she get anywhere with the rocket science? She's 58%, but that may be from her rebuilding it versus her, her failed space mission. <laughs> Because it didn't do very well. So hopefully we'll get the pop-up any minute. I'll be back when we do. Yes, she did a fantastic job. And she got a promotion. So she's going to make two forty-seven dollars per hour. She got a cash bonus. She has a desktop, which we'll put out when we get home. And she has new clothes again. And she goes to work again tomorrow. So we will be joining her at work tomorrow. Because, you know, we want to see what happens at the next tier. But she's level 10, which is one of the goals of this challenge. So, yay, we got that particular goal done. So I'm going to take her home and I'll be back when she gets there. And there's her new outfit, which we're going to now change her out. <laughs> Oops, I don't want <laughs> to go home. I want her to change her outfit. I clicked on the wrong thing. So we're going to change her outfit just into something other than what she has on. And then she... Uh, is this spoiled? No, she can eat that. She can eat that salmon. We should check out how the food is in the fridge. Everything is in good shape. Can we encourage her for her good grades? Probably too, a lot, too late now. Yep. But what we can do is influence her to do her homework. Oh, she's going to bed. Maybe we'll let her go to bed. No, it's kind of early. Why are you going to bed? This is not a good thing. And what are you doing? You're cleaning up and you have to go to the bathroom. You're going to be out of sync if you go to bed now. No, you should do your homework. Parenting influence to do homework. Forget eating. You need to tell her to do her homework. We do not want her going to bed. <laughs> Not yet. It's like 7.30 at night. It's a little ridiculous for you to go to bed now. And is she still dazed? She is for three more hours. So do your homework. No. You're going to have a shower. We'll leave you to your shower. Oh, you broke something, so we'll go fix that. Expert repair. You're still energized from that spark drive. 41 more minutes. So she's not really going to be able to go to space. Because if she was to cr go to space and crash, she can die. Because she has that day's mood light. I don't know if it matters if it's overpowered with something else. But I'm going to not take a chance on that. Because I don't usually send them to space. So you're going to come here and do a classic large painting. Well, actually, why don't you help her with her homework? Why don't you help... Parenting, encourage, doing homework. I, that's not actually what I meant. I meant for you to help her with her homework and I chose the wrong thing. She is so tired. Well, you know what we can do? Oh, good. So we're going to... I, I don't know if you can do this with teens. With kids, you can. Help with needs. Give a second wind. 
You can do that with kid children and with toddlers, but I've never tried with the teen. So we're going to try that because she's pretty tired and I would like her to stay up a little, little bit longer. And how are his needs? He's a bit tired. We'll see how this goes. <laughs> Can we encourage her again since we're now helping her with homework? Nope. No, no, no. She's, <laughs> she's got her help. Yes, yeah, so this is where I like clubs because you can get a homework boost and then it doesn't take them so long, which of course we could have taken them out and then had her do her homework there and got the homework boost. I don't know if our club has that boost, but obviously with us not out, we can't have it going. So we just have to do with, make do with what we have. She's very tired. She needs some social. She's a bit hungry. She needs to have a shower. Like I said, I just don't want her to go to bed too early because she will get up early and then it'll just like a vicious cycle. She'll be tired again. So let's see. Let's see what impact that give a second win gives on the teen. A teeny little bit. It helped her a bit. Not much. <laughs> Not much, I have to say. And she is still dazed. So why don't you come here and... Ernie, how are your traits? You still need some manners. So we're going to come here and we're going to teach you to say please and thank you. And and once we're done that, she can do what she's gone to bed. It's 9.30. Uh, I guess that's okay. <laughs> Okay, why didn't you do what I asked you to do? I asked you to teach, to pl say please and thank you. And then we're going to encourage him learning that once we can. And then we're going to, can we encourage him praise for good grades? Okay. That's different than under the parenting. Oh, is it? Learning, yes it is. So then we're going to parenting incur influence to do homework. And let's hope he goes to school tomorrow. I.e. in the next part, because that won't be in this part. So let's see how we get. When is his birthday? Which would be here. His birthday is Saturday. There we go. I don't think I'm going to have enough time to get him into... Oh, he's doing his homework. Okay, good kid. I'll be lucky to get him with two positive character values, I have to say. Oh, maybe if we, we take them all, take them both of them volunteering, he might get the volunteering. But I don't think I'm going to be focused on getting his conflict resolution up. It's not like I ever play with him or anything like that. And it's just, you know, she still has other things to get done before this house is over. So we're going to parenting, encourage, doing homework. Did he get his manners at least? Pretty close. Because of course he took a hit to his responsibility today because he didn't go to school. So now, can we friendly? Not friendly. It is under friendly. I'm just seeing if whether we can teach about responsibility just to get him a little bit, you know, up with that. Teach about responsibility. There you go. Oh, and she's, of course, in her. Oh, I even had it in the right one. <laughs> so we got her going to full parent mode. So we can't work on this anymore until. Hopefully, she might get this when Emmeline ages up, but then we won't be playing with her anyway, so it's going to be kind of irrelevant, but whatever. And she can't do, she has to go to a museum to really work on that particular one. She's kind of stuck on a lot of these things. So, she is... So, why don't we put him to bed when we're finished with that? And you're no longer dazed, so we're going to do one, going to do a space mission. Or maybe we're going to do an upgrade. We're going to expand the cargo, gay, cargo bay. That's what we're going to do. Is he going to bed? There you go. Go expand your cargo bay. And we'll see how that does with you with your... <laughs> 
how you do there. And that's going to help her with uh, getting some breakthroughs. Though even though it doesn't say she needs to get them, there are actually two that you can get. So she got her Reaper's Friend Serum, and there is one more also that she can get. And I think there was a pop-up here that... Uh, <gasps> she got to level 10! So in this part, she got to level 10 of her career, and she got to level 10 of rocket science. So now we need to install a... And it's almost Ernie's birthday. Now we need to install... Oh, we've even... We haven't finished it. It's not finished. It's not showing it. We have to install a warm hole generator, and then we can go to space with this. But we are also going to upgrade our wormhole generator at work, which will allow us to... To go to 6am is what I mean. Well, of course we can go to space already, but we can go to 6am if you install it on the rocket ship. And also if you upgrade the wormhole generator at work once you get to level 10, we can go to go to 6am that way too, which is one of the things. So, so now what we have left to do is really we want to get an alien to move in and we would like to, I'd like to go to 6M and get things from 6M to bring them back. That's kind of my, my hope and plan. But that's going to be it for this part. Thanks very much for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye! This has been Jennifer. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them below. I'd love to see them. If you liked the video, please leave a like. And if you'd like to see more videos of challenge let's plays, tutorials, and occasional speed builds, please subscribe if you haven't already done so. Thanks very much!